I'm Dr. Trevor McIver. I'm an orthopedic spine surgeon here at St. Claude Orthopedics. And we're here to talk to you today about one of the more common diagnoses of low back pain, which is SI joint dysfunction. The sacroiliac joint is a very broad joint that links the spine to the pelvis. It is in between the sacrum and the ilium, and it transmits force from the legs to the back and the back to the legs. Over time, that joint can become arthritic and start breaking down, or if there are other type of disease processes in place, such as autoimmune diseases or inflammatory diseases, those can also affect the joint and cause pain. When the sacroiliac joint becomes dysfunctional, oftentimes patients will complain of ongoing low back or buttock pain, pain rating to the back of the thigh or around the hip, oftentimes numbness and tingling in the buttock or the thigh, or even pelvic instability when standing or walking. Low back pain is one of the most common reasons patients come to the doctor, and studies have shown that between 15 and 30 percent of all low back pain can be attributed to the SI joint. Patients that have had previous lumbar fusions also will often have SI joint dysfunction as well. Part of our jobs as your physician is to try and diagnose where your pain is coming from, from your low back or from your SI joint itself. The ways we do this is by doing a history and finding out where the pain is coming from, doing a physical exam including a Fortin's finger point test where you point from where your pain feels like it's emanating. Oftentimes we'll do physical exam maneuvers to try and recreate the pain in the office. And then finally we'll oftentimes try a specific diagnostic injection into your SI joint to see if we can alleviate where that pain is coming from as well. Sacroiliac joint dysfunction is always treated conservatively first. We will try anti-inflammatories, physical therapy, diagnostic and therapeutic injections into the joint itself, as well as oftentimes radiofrequency ablation to try and alleviate the back and buttock pain. If you fail to respond for a prolonged period of time to these interventions, there is a minimally invasive surgical option that may be available for you. Here at St. Cloud Orthopedics, we use the iFuse implant system. It's a triangular metal implant that is placed across the SI joint through an approximate three centimeter incision on the side of your buttock. We will normally place three implants across the SI joint under x-ray guidance. This procedure takes approximately one hour and oftentimes patients are able to go home that same day. The iFuse implant system is the most well-researched SI joint fusion system on the market. That's why we choose to use this implant. If you suffer from chronic low back pain and think that SI joint dysfunction may play a role, contact us. We'd love to evaluate you and help treat your pain.